Hey, this is Nate. Thanks for reaching out on Facebook. Just wanted to put a quick video together, kind of give you some tips and tricks on your website. You know, scrolling down through the site, the overall layout and everything on your site looks good. Personally, I'd put a little bit more content in here. Um, Google likes to see those keywords and keyword phrases that people are searching on Google organically in the content on your site. You know, they want to be able to see that and know that your site is relevant to what people are looking for. It's not the only way to get found for keywords, but it is the fastest and easiest way for Google to find them and know that your site is relevant to what people are looking for. I put you into one of our quick scan tools. Your title tag and your H1 header are two of the most important things in Google. And we kind of want those to be generic keywords. So what you've got here with window tinting, ceramic coating, car detail, or detailing services in South Jersey, that's not bad. But it's better if we can get a city in there or at least an area. You know, I don't know how much of South Jersey you cover, but I'm in Texas, so I just don't know about much about Jersey, period. But um, we normally try to get a city in there, like the city that you're in, just to keep it very location specific. And then other people around those areas will be able to, you know, start finding you too. So I would do something, you know, I looked at the site, I would do something like, you know, West Berlin, NJ, auto detailing, dash window tinting, dash ceramic coating, and put your company name in there if you've got room for it, or maybe just do the, you know, West Berlin, NJ, auto detailing, dash ceramic coating, or dash window tinting, and then put a dash in your company name for branding. Um, but you do have some keywords in there, so that is good. Your H1 header tag is your company name. I would kind of do the same kind of generic keyword there and then put your company name just below it. I'm thinking, looking at your site, that this right here is counting as your H1 because I don't see it. It's generally one of the first things you see on the website. I'm not seeing your company name kind of bolded out anywhere else on this site. So maybe right above this, you know, put like West Berlin auto detailing and then a big company logo or something like that, just to get that H1 in there um, and get it more generic. You know, you're showing up really well for your company name. Arifs is one of the tools that we use and you're in the third position for your company name. And, but that's the only thing you've got on the first page right now. And you're showing up for a lot of keywords about coding and things like that but they're not location specific. None of these say New Jersey or West Berlin or any of, you know, cities in the area. And you want to be found locally. You know, these keywords right here, you know, there's 100 people a month looking for this one, 700 people a month looking for this one, 500 a month looking for this one, but we don't know where they are. Those people could be anywhere in the U.S. So I pulled up one of the other guys that I found. You know, in my opinion, your site looks better than his does but he is ranking in West Berlin for auto detailing. You know, I put him into the same scan tool. He doesn't have a title tag. He doesn't have a meta description. He doesn't have an H1 tag. He doesn't have H2 tags. He's really not doing anything right on that end. But, you know, Google does kind of pick up its own stuff here. If you don't put it in yourself, it just kind of picks up what it wants. So this guy's showing up for 71 keywords. You know, and, you know, auto detailing South Jersey. There's 80 people a month searching for that. He's in the number one spot. Um, car detailing South Jersey. 60 people a month looking for that. He's in the second spot. So he's got the right keywords and stuff in there. Um, he's got, you know, different towns or cities in the area. So those are the more location-specific keywords that I would target. But just to give you some examples, you know, this right here, you know, I just typed in West Berlin NJ Auto Detailing. And Yelp showed up twice, and then this guy is the one that I just showed you. But if you look at these, this blue line is your title tag. This is your meta tag description. These bolded ones are keywords that are in here. But, you know, they've got auto detailing West Berlin, auto detailing near Berlin. You know, skip his because, like I said, his is just kind of, Google just made his up out of what they found on his website. And you're right here as far as showing up. So, that is good, but, you know, work on some of that. You know, you can see most of these have something about detailing and the city. 
So the fact that yours does say South Jersey here on the end may be part of what's helping you out there, but it's kind of cut off. So I would try to get it down so that it all fits here so everybody can see exactly what it is. But other than that, you're doing well. You know, we can work on some organic ranking here. Like I said, here's your keywords that you're showing up for. Um, kind of get some of, some more of those targeted city-specific keywords in there. And we can definitely help you with that if you need it. But just wanted to give you a few quick pointers. Hope that helps you out. We'll talk to you later.